Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David, and this is a Magic Review. We have Fixed Fate from Cameron, Francis, and Big Blind Media. This is a killer trick. Uh, Francis is giving you everything you need, uh, including a special deck of cards. You are able to do an any card to any number routine uh, that's self-working, mind-boggling, and has a killer kicker ending. All right, guys, so here we are. Uh, about to show you a, a brand new trick here. Now, you know, when I perform for audiences, I like to make sure that everyone is in sync, that we're all, that we have like a, con the room has a connection, basically. So we're gonna do like a little experiment with that right now to see if that's, that's at play. Uh, Bob, I've got a prediction here, okay? Sure. And I want you to just keep your eye on it. You can even put your hand out, you can hold it, or you can leave it there, whatever you wanna do. Just make sure I don't touch it until toward the end, all right? Now, we're gonna use a little deck of cards here. And uh, here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to give the cards what's known as a true triple cut to make sure it's, it's cut really well. And that's uh, taking some cards like this, putting them down there. Actually, would you do me a favor? Cut a little bit off, put them right there. Sure. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, perfect. And then like that. Now do this. Clap your hands like Vegas to show number. I just like people to do that. It really means nothing for this trick. I just think it's fun. All right, so we gave the deck a nice triple cut. And now what I need is, um, John, I need a number. Uh, I don't want it to be too high or too low, but something reasonable like between, I don't know, like 5 and 20. Just any number between 5 and 20, what? 12. 12. Here we go. Okay, so watch. Here's what we're going to do. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12 is the 10 of diamonds, right? So 12, 10 of diamonds. Now, if we had cut the deck differently, it could have been... Another card, for example, it could be like the, uh, like the, the, the Five of Clubs. Yeah. Or it could have been uh, like the King of Hearts. Actually, it could have been any card, any card at all, if we had cut the deck differently or if you had named a different number, right? But you didn't. You said 12, and we dealt down to the uh, 10 of diamonds, yeah? yeah? All right. Now, keep in mind, too, if you had named a lower number, it could have been any one of these cards, any one of these cards at all, sure. but it is the 10 of diamonds. That's the card. Okay. Bobby, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this prediction right here, and I'm gonna prove to you guys right now that I actually predicted, I predicted that John, you would name that number, and we would deal down to that card, and I can prove it right now with my prediction. Are you guys ready? Here it is. I predicted that you would choose that number, and we'd deal down to that card. Boom! Look at that, do you see that? You see that, right? I was not lying, was I? No. Yeah, that's good, isn't it? There it is. Deal down, see, see? Right, yeah? You don't believe me though, I can tell, you're skeptical. No, seriously, look. Go ahead, go ahead, Bob, you turn it over. Go ahead, turn that card over and see that I actually did predict you would choose that card, deal down to that number, and there it is. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. I think that we are, now are all in sync. Yeah. Yes, I think it's great. Awesome. All right, so that was Cameron Francis. Uh, you might remember we've done a couple of other uh, different reviews for him and Big Blind Media as well. So a couple questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews, and the first of which is, what is in the box? What's in the box? You're gonna get a DVD, and you're gonna get a complete deck of cards. You're gonna get all the cards that you need uh, to do this trick. Uh, there's only a couple of tiny little modifications you might need to do before you do the trick, but uh, we'll get to that in a minute. Is it what I thought? I really had no idea what to think uh, going into this. I knew it was an any card to any number, and I know the solutions to some of those style effects, but what Cameron has come up with is completely ingenious. I was totally blown away. I love, love, love this effect. How are the angles on this? It's pretty much angle proof. Uh, you're just doing a straightforward card trick. There's not a lot of uh, things that you're trying to hide. Um, I guess you could say there's a possibility that you could flash, but uh, I think you could take care of that pretty easily. 
I don't, I don't think it's a, 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 I don't think it's a hard thing, and there's definitely a workaround for this. Uh, so that's just, I'm just putting that out there, just in case, just total honesty. Can it be inspected? Uh, no, you can't just like say, okay, now here's the deck and hand it out. Uh, the deck is gimmicked a little bit, a little bit, uh, but not a lot. But no, I wouldn't recommend handing it out unless you want to give away the trick. <laughs> What's the overall quality and production value of the DVD? Absolutely awesome. Everything that uh, Big Blind Media puts out uh, is really great. Uh, this DVD isn't overly uh, special or it hasn't done, you know, it doesn't have a ton of special effects or anything like that. Uh, it's just camera that's sitting at uh, like a coffee table, sitting on a couch, uh, going through the process with you. It's pretty much a steady cam. I think there's one more close up on his hands when you need it, but you don't always need it. Uh, so it's pretty straight through, but you know, Big Blind Media makes good DVDs, well lit, well mic'd, HD, everything you could possibly want. All right, so is it well made? Uh, it's a bicycle quality deck. Uh, everything you'd expect from United States Playing Card Company. Uh, any other elements to the trick, you're gonna add yourself. But this isn't one of those tricks where you really even needed uh, Big Blind Media to include the elements. You could totally make this trick again. So even if it wears out, uh, you can make another one really super simple. How much setup and reset is there? There's just a tiny bit. It's not really arts and crafts. Um, if you saw the trailer, you know that there's some writing on the back of the cards. You'll have to do that. You do your own writing. Uh, and if you do the part where he unfolds the, the letter, you, you would have to make your own letter. But other than that, uh, no, there's no arts and crafts, hardly any setup. It's just getting your deck back into a deck stack and you're good to go. Positives, positives for this. I think this puts the any card at any number uh, routine into anyone's hands. I mean, this is entry level magic but powerful magic. And I love it when those two things come together. I love it when it's simple and it looks like real magic and it comes together and you don't have to have a bunch of move monkey, uh, you know, slides to, to make a trick effective. And I think what Cameron has done is he's just streamlined this trick down to its bare bones and given you uh, all the essentials you need. It's a, I can't talk more highly about this trick. This was my favorite trick of the month, uh, yeah. Negatives, uh, there weren't any negatives to this. There, were, there was, it's rare that I don't find negatives to something, but I just didn't see any negatives to this. I, I love the DVD, I love the trick, I love the gimmick. Uh, you can make it again if you have to. Uh, he gives you everything you need. It's big blind media, what more do you want? I, psh, no negatives. Is it worth your money? It's $30, $30. Uh, you're gonna get the DVD and the full deck of cards. You know, I think, yeah, this is totally uh, what you'd expect. You know, if you bought a, a, an entire gaff deck, uh, you're at least looking at that much. And then on top of that, getting the DVD, it is a one hit wonder. Obviously, this is a trick that it, it's a standalone. This is all it does. And so you have to ask yourself whether you think it's worth the money. Um, but yeah, I, I definitely think it's in the wheelhouse. Who would like this? I think anyone who collects any card to any number tricks, I think people that like to do walk around, uh, people that have been looking for this style of trick, but that plot has always eluded them, people that like to do card tricks, people that like Big Blind Media, people that like Cameron Francis, I think would definitely love Fixed Fate. All right, so that was Fixed Fate from Cameron Francis and Big Blind Media. I wanna thank Murphy's Magic for providing this for us so that we could review it for you. And if you'd like to purchase your own, you can find it at your favorite Murphy's Magic retailer. Thanks, bye.